We have brought you the tiniest model in Ghana as well as Ghana's video fixing with the biggest hips. This time we bring you Ghanaian model with the biggest boobs. Pamela Odame Watara is no doubt a social media sensation. Google her name and you will discover she has no namesake or look alike. The extraordinary hourglass shaped girl of Kenyan and Ghanaian descent is so unique to the extent that some people even wonder if she is real or a sex doll. My mom is a Ghanaian and my dad is Kenyan but I was born there and they brought me to Ghana when I was um, 15 years. So I'm in Ghana now with my mother. 22-year-old Pamela, who is currently studying marketing at Wisconsin University in Accra, Ghana, came to limelight after joining the photo sharing platform Instagram, where she now has over 45,000 followers. Ever since, she has generated quite some storm online. This has seen her getting video vixen jobs and appearing in videos of superstars like Sarkodie, Coded of 4x4, and many more. Asked why she is in hot demand as a video vixen, she said, People would like to watch the video. If maybe I flash in it, if they see a short video and they see a lady with the big boots, they would like to continue and watch or find out the whole video, how everything. Because I think that's the main reason to catch attention to the video. Yeah. When Pamela walks on the street, she generates even a bigger buzz with her boobs. She says, "Oh, you know, it's it's they, they see it to be something amazing about me. When people see me, like they see that I have something unique um, with me or on me." They see how beautiful I am, you know, they, they feel happy when they see the kind of body that I'm having. But she also says sometimes people's comments in real life and online about her aren't pleasing at all. Sometimes I'll be working at the mall and you hear something, silicone, silicone, <laughs> silicone, <laughs> and you hear something, fake, fake. <laughs> so I'm used to it now, so sometimes I can turn and I'll be very angry as if I should go and just slap the person. Uh, so by now I'm, I'm used to it. When I go to places, you hear the girls gossiping, you know, fake, you'll be hearing some words which are very irritating and annoying. Yeah. You are alleged to be the girl with the biggest boobs in Ghana. Do you agree? No, I for the one thing. I'm not the biggest. I'm among the biggest, but I'm not the biggest. Okay. What, I'm bigger, but not the biggest. Well, what's what's your, your 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 boob size or your bust? Okay, um, I'm 44 D. Yeah, I'm 44 D in terms of um my cap, my bra is on 44 D. Okay. Yeah. So have you have you weighed it before? No, 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 no. It's, it's heavy, quite heavy, you know, it's, it's quite heavy. It's quite heavy, huh? Yeah. For someone with such endowment, there is no doubt that her big boobs must have given her some good opportunities in life. It has given me many opportunities, you know, some small, you know, the, somewhere that I'll end, I'll get things easy. Remember going to the passport office and I lost my passport. Okay. You know, the guy was like, hey, beautiful, come in. You know, it has given me some small so opportunities. Was giving special attention. Yes, that kind of, okay. you know, anywhere I get, so I'm giving something like you see. Yeah. Okay. Asked when she started discovering that her boobs were becoming abnormally big, she said, That was uh, when I was 14 years. Funny enough, one started becoming bigger than the other. This my, I think it was this one. It was, yeah, it was really big. Like this when I was in JHS 3. And this one was plus when I'm going to school, my mom will put foam in the brazier so that they won't laugh at me. So they even took me to the doctor. The doctor, I remember he was pressing my boobs, the bed, and he was like, go, oh, you go home. It will start coming. I think we need some man then this one to start it. All of the sudden they all started. So before I completed HS, my boobs was like 
Mm. At that time, people were like, hey, like, why are you boo? Have you given birth? Those whom I was school with, have you given birth? Ah, why your boobs are big? So at that time I was shy, you know. So I was always indoors. When my mom sent me, I had to go and call a friend so that he would follow me because I was shy to walk alone. People, he small gay with big boobs like this. Ah, I know this girl, just small gay, just yesterday with big big boobs like this. So people were like mm, boring, murmuring, small laughing, small. I was shy at the beginning, you know. But when I was growing up. I got used to it. The, the, the down part is not doing bad at all. Yeah. And you know one thing, because of the boobs, no one noticed like the, uh, the, 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 the down to um, heavy swole. But you know, the boobs have covered everything. Mm. Yeah. Addressing the possibility of having her breast becoming bigger, she said. Bigger, I'm not afraid or scared, but get smaller because my mom was telling me something like when I start giving bread it will reduce and I was like wow so all this it will reduce and how will I look like again so that's my fear but getting bigger and I think there's no way it's gonna get bigger where my age is now and where it has gotten to I think that's what I'm gonna be holding here yeah. also talking about them being too heavy to carry she said uh, depends on the kind of brazier you put on and the kind of breast. So I know my brazier, I know how to put it on well so that it's all, you know. It's not going to weigh me, my body is not going to weigh it. I'm, I can hold it on well, yeah. As part of helping her stay in perfect shape, Elabo Bees introduced her to Sly Gym inside Tesano, where trainer Mr. Sly promised to help her tone her entire body. No. All what she has to do is turn the stomach, right? Turn the hips, turn the leg, turn the back thigh, turn the calves. Give them very strong exercises that will, you know, keep the body in shape and strong. She has a unique physique but she has to still work on some areas of the body otherwise it will not go well at all this part of the body she has the buttocks already she has all this already she has to keep it firm keep it firm you understand now it's too soft when you shake it small then you shake it just a little firm Girl will become uh, 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 an extraordinary uh, uh, person because of the physique. Because I myself have never seen a physique like this before with the breast protruded. Pamela hopes to be an entrepreneur someday. I want to do things on my own, like to do my own products. Yeah, I want to say, okay, I did this thing, I created this thing. I mean, if I see young ladies doing fashion cream. Although it's, I really like to do those things, yeah. But she wouldn't want to explore body enhancement screen. What's your take on uh, body enhancement? Mm, I don't think it's anything bad to me. I don't know because I have it already, that's why I don't think it's anything. <laughs> if you think your body is not cool and you're not comfortable in your body, just do what will make you feel good. Like, be who you want to be, you know. Don't say people are going to... I'm not saying it's good though, but just if you think enhancing your boobs will make you happy, will make you feel free in the world, will make you happy, be part of the world, then go and do it and be yourself. Yeah, I think there's nothing wrong with that. Pamela says she would do a semi-nude photo shoot if the pay is good, but will not do a nude film. Another notable venture she is eyeing is a breast cancer campaign being planned by an organization she doesn't want to disclose their identity yet. Before ending our interviews, we always ask our celebrities who they are crushing on. In her case, she said, mm, Sakoti. He's, he's my crush, yeah. He's gentle and, you know, he's, 
he's nice. He's gentle, nice, yeah. Asked what she wants to be known for or to be remembered for in the industry, she said. Big, tall girl with the big boobs, yeah. Beautiful girl, yeah. <laughs>